Josh here from netmark.com. Just got the brand new MacBook 15.4 inches, 2.6 gigahertz, quad core. We are going to see how big of a difference the solid state drive makes to the startup time. So I've set up an experiment. So we have the 13 inch MacBook from 2009, the dual core, 2.53 gigahertz against the brand new MacBook 15.4 inch, 2.6 gigahertz quad core but the big difference being that this one has a solid state drive and this one has a regular disk hard drive. Now, I've got my wife's iPhone here. I'm using hers because I'm filming with my iPhone. I've got a timer on it so we can see exactly how long it takes to turn on both devices. We're going to say as soon as they connect to the internet that that's a successful start. I haven't updated the OS on this one. I just did a time machine backup from the 13 inch dual core to this 15 inch so they should be exactly the same I haven't updated the operating system to Mountain Lion it's just an exact replica of the 13 inch so this should be a really really good test to see which one's faster so I'm gonna go ahead and press the start button on both and then I'm gonna hit the start button as quickly as I can on my wife's iPhone so I'm gonna go ahead and set this on a book really quick Okay. All right, contestants, on your marks. Get set. Go. Nine point four seconds. Holy crap. Seven. Okay, 20 seconds. We're on the internet on the brand new one. Thirty one seconds. Got the startup page. Fifty-two seconds. One oh three, one oh four. Okay, one ten. <laughs> All right, so the brand new quad core from uh, off position to on the internet was twenty seconds. The old dual core, a minute 10. So that means that we are three and a half times as fast with the new computer. So I guess it is what it's cracked up to be. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the demo.